gorgeous, you guys. This video is going to be such a sexy video. Strap your buckles in there because we are going to have so much fun. Basically, let me just give you guys a little bit of an introduction as to what this is. I've been shopping at TJ Maxx and finding various different products from MAC, Becca, Too Faced, Kat Von D, all that since the summertime, I should say. And anytime I purchase anything, I never put the products that I purchased in my regular makeup collection drawers. I pretty much put everything aside just because I had a vision of something that I wanted to do sometime in the future. So I didn't want to kind of like mix what I already own and everything that I found at TJ Maxx. And a bunch of you guys actually realized that because you were kind of like, wait, like didn't you purchase that foundation with TJ Maxx? Like why isn't it in your drawers or where are the eyeshadows? You got me, you got my ass, but really, I was putting it in a different drawer, that's why it's not like with everything. So basically, since I really enjoy doing a lot of TJ Maxx videos, I wanted to come up with different ideas of stuff that I can do with the products that I bought, not just do the weekly vlogs, which I do enjoy, but I wanted to do something more and exciting, because I know you guys enjoy that too, right? So I was like, use your brain, use your brain, use it! And then I came up with a few ideas. So in this video, we're just going to do something small, just a little bit of a sneak peek. I purchased a bunch of different containers from the container store. So, <laughs> so I bought... <laughs> So I purchased a bunch of different containers from the container store, which I will have linked down below if you guys want to pick that up for yourself. And I want to kind of organize everything with you because at the moment, you're going to think I'm crazy, like literally insane. It's in my kitchen closet. It's like, what the hell is it doing in the kitchen? But like, I mean, I live myself. So like, it's not like I have to put anything there anyway. So I'm like, let me just utilize this space. You know, it was in a different drawer at some point, but then that overflows. I had to take everything out. Anyways, I'll show you guys where it's currently at, but I purchased these uh, container drawer drawers purposely to organize everything. So in this video, I'm gonna organize all the products with you. And then in a different video, we're gonna do some other sexified stuff. So not in a sick way, but we're gonna do something really, really fun. I was discussing it with my sister and she's like, yo, and I'm like, I know. So definitely stay tuned. You do not want to miss it. Um, I don't want to mention the idea now, but it's going to be a lot, a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and get started. If you guys think that I'm crazy in regards to how much I have, have in mind this was in a time period of like seven months that I purchased all these products. Um, but basically, if you guys think I'm crazy then or a sicko, then I possibly am. But it's fine because I really like it. You know what I mean? Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, so the lighting here is kind of crappy, but here is basically where I keep it. <laughs> I just put everything in here. Look how insane all of this looks. So freaking cool. I literally have like a TJ Maxx store in my house. It's like loaded with stuff. I'm going to take everything out and put it in my room where the lighting is better so you guys can see how delicious everything looks. But I'm kind of excited. This is, this is going to be fun. Okay, so this is what we're working with, right? Um, those are the containers that I purchased from the container store, which I will unpack everything and you guys will see. But I put everything from like the kitchen in this box and I'm like, wait, I feel like I had more. Like this just doesn't make any sense. And I'm like, oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, I am a sicko. One second. Let me show you where I kept the other stash. Like, this is crazy. I was also, like, washing my floor. But in here is basically where the magic's at. So I made these drawers dedicated for TJ Maxx finds, whatever. And then I have empty boxes here, which I have an exciting video on. But look, first of all. Okay, one second. We got a shitload of stuff in here. Oh my god! Okay, and then we have a shitload of stuff in here as well. I'm like so embarrassed. Okay, you know what? I'm not. Okay, I'm so happy. <laughs> but isn't that crazy? Let me just give you guys a little bit of an idea of what we're working with here. So here. And then here. I know you guys love this. I know you guys love this. We love this together. Oh my gosh, so excited. Okay, are you ready for this or what? I don't know. I don't know if you're ready. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Okay, so here's how the drawers look. I put in these dividers, so we have like six sections here. I did that for three of the drawers. So one, two, three. And in these drawers, I, f I figured I would put like lip products or smaller like baby things, you know? In this drawer, I just left it to divide it into two. So we'll put like palettes and stuff in here. And then in this drawer, I didn't put any dividers. So I'll put like the bigger boxes that I might have um, because they're totally not gonna fit it like in the smaller like little section. So very excited. Let's get to organizing, finally.
Okay, so the first drawer is basically lip products. These lip liners do not fit, so I'm gonna have to put them in a different drawer. But yeah, this goes in here. I'm gonna close this guy. Oh my God, loving the smoothness, it's so freaking cool. Let's go ahead and get a different drawer right now, the one that we divided into only two. And here's where I'm gonna put, um, wait, you know what I could do? I think I'm just gonna put one more of these guys. Like that. What? I think I'm gonna keep it like this. So there's two sections in the back, and then we have this like square shape right over here. So here is where I'm gonna put the lip liners. So all of these guys. So we have some Kat Von D over here, some Stila. Situate them there nicely. Here is where I'm gonna put kind of like lip palettes, like this Smashbox one, this um, lip balm actually, I'm gonna put there too. Here, I have this set from Bite, which is kind of large as well, that'll go there. This Lipstick Queen set will go here too. These lip liners from MAC are so good. I'm gonna put them here as well. No. Once again. I gotta utilize the space to the best of my ability. I don't know if I like it like this, whatever. It's staying like this for now. Okay, so here's where we're at at the moment. I kind of organized it a little bit so it should be a bit easier for the eyes. I put the bigger lip products there, which I'm going to situate in this uh, container. In this section here, I pretty much put all like the singular eyeshadows, eyeshadow palettes, some brushes here, um, liquid highlighters and powder highlighters, bronzers, cream products, all the blushers over there, the blushes. And then here is basically just still kind of a mess, but I pretty much got most of it down. So let's continue to organize. So let's try to figure this out where I could put the bigger lip products here. But it should look cutesy still, not like too boxy, you know what I mean? This goes there. This could be here. Yeah. Okay. We have some lip balms also, which I don't know if I'm going to put here for now. No. Oh, another one of these matte lip, lip liners. Um, I have this set from Kat Von D. I will situate that there. Uh, also, this Marc Jacobs set. Let me see. Yep, we got this. We got this down. Okay, this can go like that. And close this. Yay! Alright, back to these set of drawers. Let's continue organizing in here. So, I do have more of the peach lipsticks. One second. Here. More peach lipsticks are chilling over here. Ding. I love them, so cute. Oh, another. Um, some ABH lipsticks, which I'm just putting right over here. Liquid. MAC. ABH. Squish that there. Okay, perfect. This is like very, very tight. Um, more of the Buxom lipsticks, which are really great. Here, here, another, another, and another. I have this uh, Kat Von D liquid lipstick that I don't have the box for. I'll just put it there. I want to put uh, the rest of these Kat Von D liquid lipsticks just over here. Actually, over here. ABH. Here's where I'm going to put like the lip. Um, no, no, no. More ABH liquid lipstick. Which we'll put there, which we'll put here. Kevin Aquan. And this bite little set, I'll put there too. This is the um, Lipstick Queen. There, I think, I think we're good. Okay, so I think these two are pretty much good for now. I don't like this here. I'll put this in here. Okay, good. Let's get this one. In here, I'm going to put my eyeshadow palette. So I have some from MAC. Mainly, I'm going to put the MAC ones. I just think that they're so pretty. 
I'll put them like this. Yeah. I think that's it. Yeah, I think I only picked up five. <laughs> only. Um, I'm gonna put the Too Faced palettes in here as well. Here. So I have these two guys. They're just gonna chill over here for now. I have a few of these Smashbox and Bare Minerals palette, which I'm also gonna put. Found two of each, so this there, as well as this. Okay, this is looking good so far. Um, here's where I'm gonna put the bigger palette. So I have this one from Clara. I have this one from Pro Fusion, which is so beautiful. This one right here is from Cargo. Put that there as well. Makeup Revolution. Crazy, I first said in the summertime. Um, Kat Von D Channel Light Glimmer Palette. We'll put that there too. Okay, then I have these two palettes from e.l.f., which I'm just gonna put here on the side. They fit perfectly there. Um, here I'm gonna put smaller palettes like this. So I have this e.l.f. one and these, this Bare Minerals one. Um, I think I'm gonna put this trio too. Just chill that there. I think that's pretty much it in regards to eyeshadow, like actual palettes. No, this one. Okay, perfect. No. Oh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Next one I have is this one, which is a section of six. I'm going to put my singular shadow. Sorry, my foot just needs to get comfortable. So I have these two. One is from MAC and one is from NARS. I have some Lancome over here. Some Butter London. More Lancome. More Butter. And more Lancome. So I'm going to situate these guys here. As neat as possible. Oh, I want the Lancome ones there. Okay, these can go here. Right, I'm going to put this Too Faced loose glitter in here too. So there, there's that. There's where that's going to stay. So I have a bunch of these Stila Glitter and Glow highlighters. I'm going to put these here like on their own. I think that they're just so cute to see not to. So I'm going to situate them there. I think I want to also put the Stila Glitter and Glow eyeshadow. So the whole Stila Glitter family belong in here. So I can't find a lot of my Stila Glitter and Glow. I don't know where the hell they are, but I'm pretty sure they're somewhere around here. Hopefully they will be found. But I'm just going to put the ones that I do have just chilling over here. Like this for now. Okay. The next thing I'm going to put in this one is highlighters. So just like liquid highlighters highlighters all of that so i have this one from like Too faced um this milani one i have these two powder ones from bare minerals one is in tan and one is in fair delight just put that there yeah all right so my camera ended up dying so i quickly just finished organizing i'm going to show you guys everything that i put inside some of them have more of like a rhyme or reason going on and then at the end i was like i'm just stuffing stuff in some drawers because there just wasn't any more room like the biggest problem of my life you know what i'm saying i might pick up one more drawer just because i like when everything is a little bit more spacious and breathable but for now i picked up five and i guess we'll see um as time goes on but these are not staying over here i'll show you guys where i'm putting it so here's usually where my rug's at you know i'm gonna go ahead and put it like right over here so i have these drawers which are also available at the container store but in here i basically just keep like random shit and then here i have my hair products which i showed in my room tour video but i think i'm gonna put those drawers like on the side here i think it'll look really cute and i'm gonna take these out okay so here's where i situated my pride love and joy <laughs> Um, I'm gonna briefly go through some of these drawers with you guys like not too in-depth because I do want to do an in-depth TJ Maxx makeup collection video Which I know you guys would really really love so I don't want to show too too much in this video I'm just gonna show a little bit. Okay, so here's where I put my lip products mainly so back there I have some of the um, bite lipsticks ABH lipsticks here is basically where I have um, Too Faced peach lipsticks as well as the buxom ones Here's where I situated like lip balms and those kind of things. So some from um, Skin Fix, this Macaroon one, which is really cute. Here's basically where I put a bunch of the like larger lip products from like the Lip Insurance by Too Faced, Estee Lauder, some ABH liquid lipsticks and glosses down there, as well as some ABH lip glosses and Mac lip, lip glosses here too. I also put this um, like bite. Uh, multi-stick situation here's where i put the foundation so like the l'oreal one i have this um concealer and powder from kat von d whoa um stila clinique we're gonna go more in depth in the collection video don't worry okay next drawer here is basically where i put my bronzers cream contouring products um stuff like that as well as in this little section here too i put um a bunch of those guys so like so like for example this smashbox one which is so cute and then 
the Smashbox one. So here's where I have the lip products that are in like pretty large packaging. So I just stuff them here. And then down here, I just put like the lip liners from Buxom, um, Kat Von D and Steel, I think. Here I have this lip balm by Glam. Glam Glow, yeah. All right, pretty much it in this drawer. Moving down to this drawer, so cute. Here I just put like odds and ends, so some brow products, primers, eye primers, just little things that I have like one of, I just threw in here. Here's where I put my liquid and cream highlighters. So we have some like from Algenis. Um, oh, and then powder highlighters too, I didn't realize. Okay, here's where I put my singular shadow. So I wanted to put these Stila ones on their own, but there was just no space, so I had to just shove them here. Uh, we have some single shadows from Lancome. Duo from Stila, Stila Glitter and Glow Highlighters, Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadows. I don't know why the hell I only have three. For some reason, I'm like, where the hell are my other ones? I need to find them because I'm getting really, really sad. Um, here is where I just put like larger package stuff. Just I don't like this little section, but I just had to just put them somewhere. So I have this from Laura Geller, lashes, and a Becca powder. Here's where I put my blushes, so cutely set up. I love it. Lancome, Too Faced, ABH, Kevin Aquan, and then more blushes here from Too Faced, Lancome, Elf. Um, and this one right here is from Butter London. Okay, then, oh my god, I'm obsessed with these drawers. I always wanted them. Then in this drawer is basically where I put the eyeshadow palettes and then like little trios and then cream eyeshadows too. So I have two from Marc Jacobs, a bunch of eyeshadow palettes ranging from Kat Von D, some e.l.f. over here. I have some Smashbox, Too Faced in the backs, and then um, Bare Minerals. And then here's where I have all my MAC palettes, which are probably my favorite. I adore these guys so freaking much. Um, Pro Fusion, and then this one is the Bare Minerals. And then in the last drawer, we have not the most exciting products, but I basically just put like the massively packaged products in here, as well as brushes. So like these Marc Jacobs sets that I purchased, this larger bronzer from Pro Fusion that's just massive, so I just put that there. This really long brow pencil from the brand Crop, just shove that there. And then some brushes here, mainly from like Real Techniques. These are really like largely packaged. Um, and then some babies chilling here, so, and then like set as well anyways that's pretty much it um, like I mentioned a few times I'm gonna be going in depth with everything very very soon I have two more ideas of videos that I want to do with all these products so definitely stay tuned for that it's gonna be freaking exciting and a lot of fun probably gonna get my sister on board as well possibly Emma too um, but yeah that's pretty much it I hope you guys enjoyed organizing with me and seeing a little bit of a sneak peek of what I picked up for the past six months can't wait for the other TJ Maxx videos that I have in mind um, yeah, I'm looking forward to reading your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think of this one, okay? And I want to know if you think I'm crazy, okay? Bye.